see me bend, but never gon' see me break down. Show me you ain't for me, so fuck it, you in the way now. I know that they watching and wishing I lose it all now. I don't wanna love them all, wish I could be more But pain ain't never looked this good, I wear it well. Hey, what's up you guys makeups out here if you're new to my channel. Hey, what's up? And if you're returning, hey girl, hey, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. So today, um, I'm still kind of working on getting my house together. Um, it's been a while since I actually picked up the camera. This, no, I want the ones from yesterday. It's been a while since I actually picked up the camera and updated you guys. I've made a lot of changes and I've done a lot of things to the house since I've actually been here. I haven't been able to actually update you guys. Um, I've been really busy. I do have to catch you guys up on a lot because a lot of stuff has happened since I moved into this house, which is really crazy and annoying. But, um, yeah, right now what I'm actually planning on doing is putting up my new mirror for my vanity. Um, I got a new one from Walmart. I was going back and forth between where I wanted to get it from. And I just decided to get it from Walmart. I just decided to get it from Walmart. There was one day when I went to Walmart and I just picked up a bunch of random stuff. And I just decided to pick up a mirror while I was there because I found one that I actually liked. I'm going to go ahead and put that mirror up and then I'm going to probably hang up my vanity lights as well because I have done my makeup maybe once or twice since I moved in and I haven't actually been able to do my makeup accurately or the way I wanted to do it because the lights that are usually in front of me aren't and it just throws everything off so i'm gonna go ahead and do that all right you guys i am back i had to throw on my bonnet because i was tired of looking busted and crusty and um it was getting hot so i need to get the hair out of my face and off of my neck but i am back now all i need to do is move all of this stuff over here to somewhere over there so i can actually start hanging up this mirror um, I was currently in the process of trying to reorganize my inventory and I printed out some barcodes, focus, and I made and printed out some barcodes for all of my products so it's easier to do pop-up shops and restock my products. So that's what I was in the middle of doing before I decided that I wanted to go ahead and hang up this mirror i wanted to get rid of this one i actually really do like this mirror it's really big and i've loved it for so long but it's actually really heavy and i don't want to hang this on the wall because i don't think i'm actually going to be able to hang it on the wall without there being complications and also this tabletop is not attached to these dressers or not dressers they're not attached to these drawers and i don't really want them to get broken i don't want the tabletop to get broken and i don't want the drawers to get messed up if anything actually like falls or anything like that and it's already starting to be top heavy on the back half so i need to replace this mirror and also and also it's cracked on the bottom right here it's been cracked for the longest time but i basically just put like brushes and storage containers in front of it and it never really made a difference for me but now since i have to hang it on the wall because of the kind of desk that i have i need to change this out i don't really know what i want to do with it i kind of want to give it to my daughter but i don't know but this is The new mirror that I decided to get, it is a pretty decent size and it's not as heavy as the mirror that I have on my desk. So I'm going to essentially downgrade slash upgrade, which I'm excited for. I'm going to go ahead and hang this on the wall. all 
right y'all i'm back so i saw this hack on tiktok where you take a peach of peach so i saw this hack on tiktok where you take this piece of painter's tape or scotch tape something like that and you put it across whatever you're actually trying to hang up and you put markers on both sides of the tape i do not have any painter's tape or scotch tape all i have is packing tape and shipping tape so i'm about to use this and it should be about the same thing and hopefully it'll go all right so i'm about to find something that i can mark this with or just poke a hole in both of these sides and then hopefully that will be good enough and that will work but we're about to find out <laughs> So apparently this actually worked. I used a permanent marker to put this X on here and it's not coming off, but it also took off all of the backing, which is fine because nobody's looking at that anyways. So I'm about to take this tabletop off of here so I can get to this wall better. Hey, what's up guys? I am back and as you can see, I am making progress. I just got this light up on the wall. I'm about to put up the next one in a second. I didn't film me putting up the first one because I kind of thought there was going to be some minor setbacks which there were it took me forever to screw in this light fully it won't take me forever to do this next one and i can go ahead and plug these up and get my desk looking the way it needs to look i just been balling out every season know some niggas i left in the piece i just been married to double cup i gotta pull me a four inside another piece time to pass and then run it up i gotta put the new bills inside of the freeze back at the trap i was dug in the people dug in the birds and then out the meagles all of my diamonds gonna bust out the meal i'm dripping water and i can eat them get up with seven if you think i need them get it one time and then i gotta leave them i'm a real street nigga gotta keep it erect with my people turn a whole squad to bosses i can't be kicking shit like i'm a teeter young nigga pulling up inside the building truck i just be popping shit like hot grease i'm in my bed sitting at the trap about to call the plug got a cop three look at the pablo escobar money meet the top four that's my top three bitch i was serving the sidewalk then i top of the drop hop in the street you can't never young nigga that's hot as me all my niggas do murders and robbers got about 20 racks in the rabbit jeans niggas thinking i won off the lottery when i hop in the push start with the pound niggas know that it ain't no stopping me out of town trap like me brother got a new key up off the box and ring put the new 40 out of some the deep run up 30 in a week i just fuck out on deep 45 under the pillow boy all right y'all so the mirror has been put on the wall and i just got done putting the little metal things that hold the covering plate back on now i need to plug up this really old disgusting needs to be replaced extension cord to both of those cords that you see hanging down from my vanity lights and then plug it into this um it's over here plug it into this dimmer switch i got this dimmer switch from lowe's about three four nope i got this dimmer switch probably about five years ago so 
Yeah, I got this from Lowe's. I definitely suggest getting one if you want to make your lights brighter or darker or anything like that. So, yeah, I need to plug this into this. It took a while for me to actually get this plug in this end of the extension cord. I really need to replace this. But, um, yeah, so basically all you have to do is take these two cords from both of the vanity lights, plug them into an extension cord, and plug that extension cord into the dimmer switch. So that way... I'm gonna get up here so I can show you guys. I already put one bulb in there so that way I can test to see if it was actually working, if the um, cord had messed up or anything like that. But when you move the switch down, it gets brighter and then you move it up and it gets darker and then it eventually goes out. So yeah, I really recommend Having one of these dimmer switches, absolutely love it. So yeah, I absolutely recommend having one of these dimmer switches. For your vanity lights, it just makes everything so much easier. When it comes to doing your makeup, you can have different lighting. So now I can finally take this box of bulbs that I've been storing in the corner of my office for ever with this bubble wrap back on my lights. I believe I have another one of these. This one is blown out. I think I see what's wrong with it. Yeah, the part that actually connects it together popped. I found another light bulb in my closet. This is definitely not the right bulbs for this because these are clear and this one is obviously white. But these are the only ones that I have and I don't really like having that blank spot right there. And I was thinking about switching these to all white bulbs anyways. So when all the rest of these burnout I will switch to all white that one is such an eyesore but it looks better aesthetically especially with the rose gold I'm also thinking about painting the coverings but for right now they're gonna stay rose gold the only thing is they're not as good when it comes to dimming as the clear ones are.